here again with you from Auto House of Naples. And uh, last night, you'll see I did do a drive down in this uh, vehicle. It's a 1989, which I'll get to in a second. Um, however, we realized we had a camera malfunction and the volume didn't work. Therefore, uh, we came here to eat lunch and they're closed. So we're just gonna do a quick video so you can actually see um, this car. It's the most iconic sports car ever to be made. 1989 Porsche 9 Alpha which is a 911 Carrera, and it is a convertible, and it's finished in beautiful uh, Porsche black with the nice tan leather interior. It appears to be all original on the outside and the inside, especially uh, the leather and the carpeting. And uh, I believe I possibly still have a video of me showing you the top operation. Hopefully that part works. If nothing else, it'll just not have the volume. Um, however, we acquired this car from a man here locally in Naples, and you guys know how it is in Naples. Everybody has their uh, garages full of their collectibles, and this is one of his items. And this is, I believe, a uh, G or SC model, which is what they call it. And I want to say it's the last year of the G50. Um, transmission so I'm sorry I'm distracted um, anyhow here on the uh, in the trunk space in the front you can see that there is just a little bit of trunk space but everything again is original we have the uh, matching numbers as well and everything is in place beautiful so underneath there okay I'm so sorry about that it is daytime so we just got a phone call from a customer um, like I said it's matching numbers accident free you can see that on the carfax it has uh the cleaning clear carfax and once again you were able to see um, those matching numbers i do ask for your forgiveness because this video is going to be quite different than all the other ones but we just really want to show you uh, the purity of this car and how amazing it is like i said it is a collectible it's definitely um one that is to be sought after especially uh, for the 1989s uh, being the last year of the G50 transmission, it is very uh, desirable and much easier to drive, handle, and also uh, the clutch is actually easier to uh, use as well. And I will show you more of the inside whenever I do take it out on test drive, but uh, you can see that everything is there, perfect, pretty, nice, um, you know, you can see there's a little bit of wear, but just a tiny bit. It's a little patina. It's okay, uh, but nothing that would offend you. And you can see the tires are awesome as well. We do have a flat six engine. It's a 3.2 liter uh, engine, and it's a flat six. It has about 200, I believe, 14 horsepower. So, uh, and it is an air-cooled engine, which is so super cool. Uh, so again, a 3.2 liter air-cooled flat six engine and it produces about 214 horsepower. This car is very comfortable to drive and to ride in. It's something that you and your spouse can take out for a weekend, get away, you know, drive three, four hours, and uh, really enjoy the car, especially in the curvy roads because that's where it's the most fun to uh, drive this car. So I'm going to take it out for a test drive. I'm gonna show you uh, the startup. All right, I'm going to get the car started off. You can hear the engine, 71,000 miles. All right, as you can see, we have 71,000 miles in the car. It has been driven and it's been very gentle miles, nothing excessive. Uh, the car is obviously very well loved. You can see from the dash, there's no cracks, no fading, very beautiful. Um, like I said, this was a garage queen from its owners. I'm sorry, I just rolled the windows up so we can hear. Um, and um, definitely well maintained and well loved. I am going to be taking this car out on a test drive right next to one of the busiest private airports in the nation. It is the Naples Airport. So you might get to see some fun activity there. It might be loud as well. 
Um, but it is also going to be a little um, turns, so you might like that because a lot of times our Google test drives are on a straightaway. Uh, you can also see from the instrument cluster here that everything is in working order. The tachometer is right in front of you, so you can definitely keep an eye on your RPMs. I know uh, back in the day that was definitely important because you wanted to make sure you were not red lighting your uh, vehicles. There is a little plane about to take off. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's going around now, but this is also cool here on the turn. Handles well, the suspension's awesome in this car. It's definitely not my first time taking it around the uh, curves and turns of these roads. It really is a collectible. Anybody who's interested in it should definitely give us a call. This car um, would not let me down at all. It is a wonderful vehicle. Uh, oh, look, and one of the, the funny things is the uh, radar detector. There's a radar detector built into this vehicle as well. So, oh, and the air is so cold I had to turn it down today. So, <laughs> definitely a perfect car. Good for everybody. Like I said, I apologize for the random impromptu video, but uh, we just wanted to go ahead and knock this out.